The Oakland High School Wildcats travel to Minden, Nevada to play the Douglas High School Tigers. The Wildcats play in the highly acclaimed Oakland Athletic League in California. The Tigers play in the always tough Northern Sierra League in Nevada. The Oakland High School Wildcats are coached by Orlando Watkins. The Douglas High School Tigers are coached by Corey Thacker. The scoring in the game started when Douglas' senior point guard Jordan Warren passed a fellow senior Ryan Barnes for a Tigers basket. Oakland senior Jalen Dumay made a nice steal and started the Wildcats' fast break, getting the ball to senior Jeremiah Baines for a layup. The Wildcats showed great patience, with Baines getting triple teamed, then passing to Dumay, who fired a pass down low to Devon Banks for an easy basket. Douglas ran an outstanding out-of-bounds play with Warren getting the ball to Reagan Robertson for a Tiger basket to make the score seven apiece at the end of the first quarter. Oakland junior Solomon Pierre Bland made a steal, passed to Banks, then got the ball back for a layup. Oakland junior Amari Harris made an outstanding pass to Pierre Bland for another Wildcat score. Douglas's Warren showed off his playmaking skills by dribbling to the right then making a perfect pass to senior Dalton Davis for a Tiger basket. Oakland's Jeremiah Baines went high for a pass, then showed great quickness driving the baseline for an Oakland score. The Tigers' Trey Jackson grabbed a pass and was double teamed. The senior dribbled out of trouble and hit a mid-range jumper. With Devon Banks knocking the ball loose, then showed outstanding ball handling skills, keeping the possession of the ball before passing to Natna Ogbe, who found Pierre Bland for a layup. Douglas employed a tough zone defense, and Oakland senior Devon Banks shot right over the top of it for a three-pointer for the Wildcats. With Douglas still in his own defense, Banks once again shot a three for Oakland. Oakland's Amari Harris slipped in for an offensive rebound, then made a nice put-back basket. Douglas's Warren was left wide open, and the senior drained a three for the Tigers. The halftime score, the Douglas Tigers 17, the Oakland Wildcats 23. The second half started with Oakland's Jeremiah Baines making a steal, spinning, then making a layup. The Tigers' Warren found junior center Ian Izonlins open in the key for two of his nine points. The Wildcats' Ogbe passed to Harris, who made a great assist to Dumay for two of his seven points. Trey Jackson found Barnes all alone for a Tiger three-pointer. Oakland's Harris fought for a rebound, then made an outstanding pass to senior Joseph Holden for a Wildcat basket. Barnes showed his great ball handling skills by dribbling up court and making a mid-range jumper. Barnes then made another outstanding move to the basket for another Tiger score. The Douglas senior passed to Trey Jackson for a layup. Barnes then showed his defensive abilities by knocking a Wildcats pass into the stands. Trey Jackson intercepting an inbounds pass and making a resounding dunks for the Tigers to give him 13 points for the game. Oakland's Holden made a nice steal of the inbounds pass and drove to the basket for an Oakland score. The score going into the fourth quarter, Douglas Tigers 30, Oakland Wildcats 35. To get the fourth quarter underway, the Wildcats Ogbe passed to Pierre Bland and the junior drove to the basket for two of his nine points. Douglas showed good teamwork with Warren scooping up a loose ball and passing to Barnes who found Jackson open for a three-pointer. Oakland's Jeremiah Baines made an outstanding play when he brought the ball up court, then drove to the basket for a thundering dunk to give him 10 points for the game. The Wildcats' good teamwork was on display when Baines passed to Dumay, who dished to Ogbe for a layup. The Tigers fought through a tough Oakland defense when Barnes found junior Ian Azonlins, who somehow kept possession of the ball and made a jumper in the paint. The Tigers' Barnes made a jumper for two of his 12 points for Douglas. The Tigers kept clawing back as Trey Jackson grabbed a rebound and went coast to coast to make the score 41 Tigers, 42 Oakland, with three minutes and 15 seconds left in the game. The Wildcats did some clawing of their own as Banks passed to Pierre Bland, who quickly passed back to Banks for a nice layup off the glass. 
Banks then made a great steal and drove to the basket for two of his 12 points. But there was no quit in the Tigers as Jackson found Barnes open for a three and the senior nailed the shot. To make the score 45 to 47 with exactly one minute left in the game. Oakland's Ogbe drove to the basket, then passed to Wildcats sharpshooting James Holden for a clutch three-pointer. Holden was fouled, and the senior calmly sank both his free throws. Once again, Holden was fouled, and once again, he sank both his free throws for the Wildcats to give him 11 points for the game. The final score of this outstanding contest, the Douglas Tigers 46, the Oakland Wildcats 54.